This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. MicroStation provides a pop-up calculator that can be activated in AccuDraw's X and Y input windows and the Z window if you're working in a 3D file. In addition to the four basic math functions, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division, the calculator will handle more complex expressions. Using the calculator is actually very simple. Let me demonstrate with a simple line. And let's say I want to draw a line which is the sum of two separate dimensions. Start the line, drag the first direction, and enter the first dimension. Let's say it's 500. 500 at the keyboard. Now I want to add the second part of this dimension. I hit the plus key on the keyboard and note that the calculator has popped up above the AccuDraw window. Now I enter the second of the two dimensional values. Let's say it's 750. And my line is now 1250 millimeters long, which is the length I need. So I would left click to accept that and continue with the drawing process. So that's a fairly straightforward example. Let me undo that. Now look at the figure here. This is a U-shaped object with a line which is at the midpoint between this snap point and this snap point. Now normally to do this I would have to probably draw a construction line from there to there, find the midpoint and draw the line. But the calculator can do this for us. Let me show you. Line tool is still running. Let me draw the U-shaped object first. Enter, snap, and draw. Now to find the midpoint, I need a calculation because I have no specific dimensions here. So, line tool still running. Find this snap point. Locate the compass at that point. Press the O key. Drag across to the opposing snap point. And now I need to divide that dynamic line by 2. So, use the forward slash symbol for divide. There's my divider pop-up. Enter 2 to find the halfway distance. There's the new tentative point halfway along the dynamic line. I accept it and drag upwards. Very straightforward again and the calculator has done all the work for me. You'll find a couple of other examples in your AccuDraw exercises file. As I mentioned earlier, the calculator will accept complex expressions, including multiple operators, parentheses, C expressions, trigonometry, and variables. You can also mix and match the format of the input, and MicroStation will interpret them correctly. Now let me add a couple of other shortcuts, not relating to the calculator at all. Clearly you're not going to remember every single shortcut. So you need to see a list of shortcuts as a pop-up on the screen. You can do this two ways. With Focus in AccuDraw, F11, press the G key on the keyboard. That pops up a list of the AccuDraw shortcuts. And you can scroll through that list quite easily and see the shortcut that you need. Another way is to press the question mark on your keyboard. So shift and question mark. This pops up another list, slightly more informative list. This one you can actually extend if you wish to see more. Still a slider, but you can see more shortcuts. And you can select a shortcut and run it directly from here if you wish. You can also edit the shortcuts and create new ones, but those will be looked at in a different course. Now one final thing, you'll notice that in this whole series of AccuDraw shortcuts that I have not used construction lines to place any of the geometry. Now this is one of the efficiency advantages of the AccuDraw shortcuts. You can usually find a way to use a shortcut to avoid the use of construction lines, which makes the drawing process much, much faster. Now it doesn't mean that you can't use construction lines, and in some cases you will need to use construction lines, but for the most part, you try very hard not to enter construction lines because that simply slows the drawing process. So it would be really helpful if you went back over this series of AccuDraw videos and practice again if you need to. Very important that you understand how AccuDraw and the shortcuts work 
because of the extremely important drawing efficiencies that AccuDraw brings. Go forth and practice.